Okay, we got some swallowing action. <coughs> All right. Welcome to Scotch Bonnet Week on Brian Name's YouTube channel. Alex is not eating anything today, and I'm sorry, Alex. Let me skip over. Let me <laughs> skew right over this Wikipedia. Hold on, hold on. I'm sorry. I think my stomach still hurts. I'm from sorry. That. Yeah. I'm sorry. I really I, did not think it was going to happen. Dude, I don't know. The effects of that, they don't like me. So, this past week, you guys saw us eat the, with, uh, with, uh, with, Justin. uh, Justin, that's the guy. That's the guy. He was <laughs> sitting right here, and we had chocolate covered, uh, Scotch bonnets from M. Cacao, like my all time favorite. Chocolate maker mm -hmm. could not be more excited about what was happening in that video. <laughs> and Alex had a scotch bonnet, and it was a little warm. It and was, it, yes, it was warm. It was warm, <laughs> and he had a little crampy time, and he had it wasn't fun for him. So it, uh, my retribution, I guess, is so he's just here. He's not eating it. You're you're not. I will I will rip it out of your mouth. If you're I, not doing it. This is not like if this was like two weeks later. And this I'm is over, not the chocolate. Might, this is not the chocolate video. My stomach is telling me, do not. Touch you this. you are not going. I will to. not touch this. Correct. Okay. So. These are Scotch bonnets. They were sent to me by my wonderful friend Zach Perkins from uh, High Desert Hot Sauce Company. Okay. Okay. And I, I don't know why this is coming to uh, like a uh, what's it coming to fruition? Coming to a, an end? Coming to a, a it's, it's it's happening. <laughs> <laughs> I talk about on my YouTube channel all the time that yes. I, I want to try Scotch bonnet, and then yeah, all of a sudden I'm, I, I've got all the Scotch bonnets in the world. Right. They're raining on, on me in every yeah. way, shape, or form. <laughs> okay. Uh, let me get a knife. Uh, this these is, are definitely smaller than what we ate the other day. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So he got these from a grower, and she called them button peppers. I want to say. Okay. I can see why that. Yeah. Like so smushed. Like yes. Flattened. So I think when it was dipped in chocolate. So it also look at the Wikipedia page right there. You see that? That's kind of more of the shape of the one yeah, that we had eaten. It's like a mini bell pepper. They are varying in size and shape. Hmm, okay. Interesting. So I don't really know why. How long have these been around? Scotch bonnets for a while. Scotch bonnets is also a body pepper or a Caribbean red pepper. It's a variety of a chili pepper named its resemblance of a tam or a shanter hat. You know, shanter hat. Okay, you know, yeah. It's like you know what I'm saying. Okay. Like one of those. Mm -hmm. Think of it as like a hat. It's, it's, I, I see it in this. Yeah, you, know, you see it. I see it. Um, so we're talking 100,000 to 350,000 Scoville. It's a very different. That's a broad range. It's a very broad range. And like I said, it all depends on how good you are growing. It all depends on okay. uh, like the temperatures, how good of a growing season it is. Is it really dry? Because it's going to make it super hot if it's dry because the plant's like, I'm trying to make this pepper survive. So it basically kills itself and yeah. then sends all of its nutrients directly to the pepper, making it spicier. Okay. okay. Uh, it says fresh ripe scotch bonnets can change from uh, green to yellow to scarlet red. Some varieties of this pepper can ripen to orange, yellow, peach, or even a chocolate brown. Right. Wow, a chocolate version of this would be awesome. Um, or a peach version. But you're going to get it. Oh, a happen. peach scotch bonnet that might be... like a peach scotch bonnet. Like a color peach. Peach peppers are the most okay. delicious peppers I've ever had. Like a, a Jay's peach ghost is... Yeah. One of the hottest peppers I've ever had, but also one of the most delicious peppers I've ever had. Anyways, okay. Which one do you want me to eat? All of them. No. So you're here to kind of try to cause me pain. So I want you to... I, I want you to eat them all. I'm not going to eat them all. <laughs> I'm going to eat one. And you're going to tell me which one you want me to eat. I feel the weight. This one's pretty oily. You're going that one. That one? That's the one I want to eat, so that's oh, good. Oh, great. <laughs> all right. I'm going to set these aside. All right, so... This is what this pepper looks like. It's beautiful. Uh, it's, it feels very hollow, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I'm going to cut it open just to make sure that there's nothing gnarly going on in the insides <laughs> of it. So, cut it in half. Just make sure there's nothing like... Yeah, this section destroyed me. Yeah, so that, <laughs> piece, that, section, that section right here gave some bad times for Alex. Yeah. I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna remove the uh, the green like. I think my screw. biggest mistake was not, not eating, eating the it. whole thing to be able to mix it all together. Mm -hmm. I ate the first half and it was just it wasn't too bad. And then that second half was I'm just gnarly. I'll try to re replicate that experience. <laughs> I mean I don't know if you can. I'm you just gonna yeah, I'm gonna eat half and half. Uh, squeeze it into your eyes. No. Oh. Um. Okay. Let me see how it smells. It doesn't smell super hot. It smells very vegetative. Yeah. Yeah. Um, it smells kind of fruity. Does that mean it's not been ripe long enough? Oh, it's definitely ripe. Mm. It smells really good, actually. It smells fruity. Uh, do that one first. This one first? All right. I'll eat this half, and I'll yeah. chew it up, swallow it. Wait a second. And then I'll go for it to sure. try to elongate the experience. Sounds good. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> 
It's fruity. Yeah. But this is a taste you like. I love this. Yeah. Can't say I, I like it. It's got a little bit of heat. I would hope so. Can you pinpoint? Is it 100,000 <coughs> or 350,000? <coughs> okay, we got some swallowing action. <coughs> All right, he's turning red. It's very tasty. Um, Fruity, okay, the, the right, right now, the burn is only on my left tongue wing currently. Okay. Not in the back of the throat. Mm, it's it's kind of it's 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 pushing its way down the back of my throat. Is Actually, it yeah. Stingy? Yeah, it is. But it's weird. It's not top of the tongue stingy. It's like back of the tongue stinging. Take a big deep breath in. What does that feel like? It feels very good. Actually. <laughs> <laughs> right, you think it's right? Am I ready? Yeah, you're ready. Yeah. I almost uh, <laughs> you got it on your lip. I almost now. missed it. <laughs> It's it's sweet too. Yeah. It's sweet and fruity. Um It's a pleasant pepper <laughs> pepper. Pleasant be, burn? It's a pleasant pepper to be eating. Yeah. Like <clears throat> You think most people would just eat this like you're eating it? Yeah, I you should be. Um <laughs> this actually be really good on pizza. Okay, I could see people doing that. Or like actually like chopping this up and putting this on like a hummus mm -hmm. or like adding this and using this inside of salsa. I think sure. salsa would be really good. I would I would try it in some salsa. Yeah. Make it nice and fine. The okay. That's now the tongue. Now it's on the tip of my tongue. Top of the tongue. Tip of the tongue. Uh, both tongue wings and the back of my uh, tongue, and ever so slightly in the back of the throat. I think this is more mild than the one that we ate. I would assume so. I think it's definitely more Dude, mild. Dude, <laughs> we had like double the size. Yes, eat another one. I just want to see, if, like. What the experience on the inside of this one looks like. It's pretty weak, actually. Yeah, it does look pretty weak. <clears throat> actually, the longer I sit <coughs> with it, <laughs> it's a little it's the building. Slightly. You're not. I mean, you're red, but you're not. <sighs> you're not really sweating. I see. The weird thing is, is that like, I can ever so slightly feel it in my stomach right now. Already? Yeah, like it. I don't know what it is with me, and like it might be a mental thing too. It's got to be a mental thing. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna eat this other half right here. Um, way know. juicier, yeah. way fruitier. Yeah. Doesn't sound way. Juicier. So the more orange it gets, uh -huh. a lot of the fruit comes out. So you think that yellow one would be spicier? Yeah, it's a more it's more vegetative, more like um, um. Le lack less flavor. That one's definitely more ripe and way hotter. Is it? Really? Yeah. Way hotter. Wow, way hotter. <laughs> Dude. Way hotter. That, this second, that half of the second one is probably five times hotter than the, the first half. What? Seriously? Like the first one, I got like, I got a burn, but it was very like muted. For like sure. I'm talking like, it felt like I did less than a jalapeno. The first one the first felt one. like that. Yeah, like the burn. Why the burn wise for me? The second one, this is back of the throat, back of the tongue, real deal burn. It feels like um, like it's very oily. Like, like yeah, I can see that. On it there. feels like, I, it feels like the oil burns. Like almost like a. It feels weird to say like a tincture burn. Like the way the oil hits you. Like I, I feel like the oils from the peppers wherever the oil hit. That's where I'm like experiencing the burn right now. Um, <laughs> but I'm still chilling. I'm gonna say it is a three. Three out of ten. Okay. I'm gonna say on my heat scale, um, I'm gonna say that it's honestly probably closer to like the hundred thousand or maybe even eighty thousand to hundred thousand. What? It's kind of what I'm feeling like it yeah. is right now. This is definitely not like the heat of a fresh habanero. Like I've eaten a lot of fresh habaneros, and that is a habaneros are a coin. It flip. is a yes, it is. <laughs> and then, but it's normally like a really potent, stingy, painful yeah. burn. Yeah, and this is like a, a muted version of that. Like you are getting that sting, but it's not like overbearing. Like the panic, or like the just it, habanero burns are just annoying. It's just like it's like it pisses well, I think because you like the flavor of this too. I like the flavor of habaneros too. Oh, you but do. this is like even juicier, even fruitier than habaneros. Okay, absolutely, my favorite pepper. Absolutely. Not mine. Okay. <laughs> uh, in, the, in the description below is a bunch of Alex stuff. Woo! Check out Alex for sitting in this video with me. Wow, um, thanks. Scotch Come bonnets. Uh, I love this pepper. Search it out. Eat sauces with it. Use it in cooking. 
Can't speak highly enough about it. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. (laughs) Hope you enjoyed it. See you guys on the next. Hey, this is Brian Ames. Uh, Please click the subscribe button that you see right there, and uh, you'll subscribe to my videos. Uh, From now on, I'm going to be eating a lot of peppers. It's going (laughs) to, oh man, it's going to be great. Bye.